I am here to show you all the results of the voting for last week. I want to thank everybody for coming on and voting for the thread to go on this makeup bag. Um, but unfortunately, it's still tied. So everybody like almost voted for the same thing. So these were the colors. This was a bronze. This was a white. This was a gray. So what I was going to do is the first person to comment with your initials, I'll stitch your name on it and it'll be your bag. Hey y'all, who we got on here? Hey Brandy, hey Chloe, hey Danielle, hey Katie. All right, so start um, messaging the first name I see come across there. Well, you have to do the initials and put it in first, last, middle name. And I'll choose the font. Jamie won. All right, so is that the order you want it in? J M N. Jamie, speak now. I'll choose the font. Let's scooch y'all over. Oh, Sharice. Yours would have been next. All right. It's so quiet when you do a, a live. I wish I could hear y'all. Okay, so J N M. That's what I'm gonna stitch. Everybody else that put your initials, this bag will be for sale. You can buy it. All right. So the initials. J N uh -oh. M Did I do that right? It has to be in the middle. In the middle. All right, let me see if I can show y'all what I'm looking at. Can you see it? That, that's on my program. I use Monogram Wizard for this one. Okay, good. Perfect. All right, and then I just save it. So it'll be about, about a four by four on here. And y'all can watch me stitch it if you have time. Stay with me. So about a four by four, that's gonna be about here to here. Oh, Jamie, what color thread do you want? The bronze, the brown, I mean the gray, or the white? Speak now or I'll pick it. Oh look, and there's this little purple color. While we wait, who's on here? Let me wave at y'all. Hey. Hey, Belinda. Hey, Yanza. All right, there she is. Okay, purple. Oh, well, Felicia. Hey, Felicia. Um, Jamie has to pick it because she, um, she put her initials in first. Okay, bronze. She said bronze. I'm gonna turn it so y'all can see what I do. I have, to, I have to thread it. Let me see if I can do this quickly. Jamie, you need to be watching this since you want lessons. Here go your lessons. You should be over here with me sewing, actually. On a Sunday. I should do this every Sunday. Will y'all watch if I do this every Sunday? No? Yeah? We'll call it So Sweet Sundays. <laughs> okay. So I'm just threading it now. It's quick, I promise. And then it comes. 
comes around over here to my machine, pull it up. Stick it on like so, can y'all see? All right, so it's gonna get loud when I start to sew, so you may not be able to hear me, so. But I'll still be here. Stitching away. And since it's plush, I use this right here. It's a water-soluble film. I feel so bad. I'm not talking to any of you all. I should be reading. I need. I should have gone live when Kara was here so she could read my comments. Since she always reading my text messages. Okay. Oh, so this is a water-soluble. Jamie, this is the same thing that I told you to use on your blanket that time. And I just take it down. You can, you can put it down any way you want but I just usually tape it. And the good thing about this bag, you don't really have to find um, center as much because it's just all one little thing. All right. And then we move it back. I'm making sure underneath here it's not in the way. Hey, Sierra. I'm making sure it's not in the way because otherwise it can get stuck underneath there and then I stitch it all together. I have done that on plenty of occasions. All right, then we gotta get this little dot. There's a little dot. Let me see. Let me get y'all in here with me. Can y'all see a dot? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. All right, so there's a dot. And I have to get that centered. Oh, shoot. Or sometimes you just make a mistake and hit the wrong button. It goes all the way back to the beginning. All right, and then... Can I turn this thing around? Oh, that's so much easier. All right, there's my dot. And then I check my corners to see where it's going to sew. So all through there, make sure it's not going to hit. This is going to be big. And then, so that was the things I was using to move it around. And Jamie, your machine, even though it's a single needle, it still looks a little similar to this. All right, so then I, I like where I put it, so I'm gonna hit sewing. And then I chose that thread, so that's in the position number five. All right. And lock. And I usually say a little prayer before I do it because sometimes I mess up. All right, here we go. We're sewing. It's going to take, ooh, it'll take 11 minutes. So I'm going to still talk. I don't know if y'all hear me.
and sew with me too. Do you still have your machine? Felicia, you have a machine. You need to put it to work. better because I do have a pair of scissors that I want to show. They were a good pair of snips. Oh, look at this. So these, they have, these are good for applique. They have like a little curved edge and it gets close to the material. These right here are Pelican scissors. Y'all, I used to be in so much trouble when I was younger from playing with my mom's Pelican scissors paper with all her scissors. And then my sister will be like some control. But, you know, I have a um, I have tweezers, simple tweezers, because sometimes like in between like that right there, I just pull it these tweezers to get out. So 
it looks like yeah, the only jump stick thing that I have is going to be over on that M, so I'll fix that. And it's all done. It's all said and done. Yeah. So this looks like it's a simple water bottle. What I use this for, once it's all done, I spray it. Like I'll pull it off and then I spray it and it, it takes out that water soluble pen and this water soluble material. Okay. Almost done, two minutes. Sometimes I'll get my tweezers and do all this. All right, and just for the sake of time, I'm going to show you all how I use my snag nabbit. Oh, this color came out cute. So it has like a little serrated end. I mean, serrated end. Yeah. And I take it wherever the little thing is sticking up. And I stick it straight through there and pull it. Uh, well, anyway, I pull it cute hairstyle thank you Susan I was just thinking I needed to do something to my hair and I do it by all of these anywhere it has a little stitch just put pull it through and it makes it look like it never happened all right so all right and one last thing All right, so then I take, I just take my tweezers and I pull it off from there. Let me move. I can, oh, I can move that. There you go. Now I see. Just pull it off like that. I would like to say I don't just like let it throw, let it fall on the floor like I just, you know, have a trash can and I put everything in there as I go, but I don't. My floor has all kind of thread and stuff. All right, Jamie. Oh, I have one, I see one more place. So, I'm a perfectionist, and it's a blessing and a curse. Because then, it's like I feel like I have to get everything perfect. All right. I'll finish that off camera. All right. Anyway. Look. Boom. There you go. J-N-M. J, uh, J -N -M. 
Is it backwards? I hope it's not backwards. It looks backwards to me. But if it's not backwards, there you go. All right, that means you got to come get it. You live right across the highway. Bye. Thank y'all for watching. Let me see what else. Oh, you need one of these, Sharice? Let me show you. Girl, I got a lot. There is enough to go around. I can get, I can do one for all of y'all on here. Everybody. And your mama. Just send me your email or your PayPal and I'll invoice you. Superior customer service. I try, Susan. I like to give good customer service. All right, y'all. Well, that's it. This was fun. I think I might do this again. Thanks for sharing. Thank you, Dietrich, for watching. Oh, look at all these hearts. All right, y'all. Bye. Oh, shoot. Oh, wait. Okay, bye. Okay, I had to hit finish. All right, bye.